Hello, friends. You like my hair? Just gonna just bomb my video. You like my hair? It's cute. Okay, bye. What's up, YouTube? This one is a viewer requested. Let's see, Long Beach Most Wanted says, can you show how you run your outboard gear through Studio One uh, pipeline? So I have my SSL2 Plus. Any audio is gonna be routed out of the SSL2 Plus using the outputs, going into the Fusion, back out of the Fusion, and into the inputs of the SSL2. So we have our session loaded up. So all pipeline is, is Studio One's plugin to route audio from Studio One out into your hardware gear and then back into Studio One without having to, to load up any other uh, aux channels or, or other effects channels. It just does it right in pipelines, pretty streamlined, really simple. So the first thing you wanna do is just wanna open up your IO. That's your ins and your outs, your inputs and your outputs. Let's start with outputs. I want to add a stereo output routing and I have an SSL2 Plus which has two sets of outputs. So I have uh, set one, output one and two and outputs three and four. That's your left and your right. So in Studio One, I want to send audio from my track out outputs one and two. All of these other outputs are for my Apollo Twin and my Apollo Firewire. So I don't need those and I know my SSL2 Plus. I know that this is my SSL2 Plus and I have it going out of outputs one and two. And I can go ahead and name this SSL2 Plus and I can even call it Fusion. Switch over to your inputs and do the same thing. So you want to add a stereo routing. And I know at the very last, my inputs one and two. These, this, I know for sure that this is for my SSL2, two plus. And this is my SSL2 plus fusion. And I can even say input, just so I could tell the difference when I'm looking for it in pipeline. I'm gonna click apply. And now I'm ready to route my audio. So let's play the audio. So that's the audio. The audio is playing through nicely. Let's turn our plugin on. So you're getting signal going out of Studio One and into Pipeline. We just need to tell Pipeline which audio routing path are we using to send this audio through to our hardware and which routing path are we using to receive the processed signal back into Studio One. So really simple in Studio One. We've named it. We have our SSL2 Plus, and I've named it the Fusion because it's going through my SSL Fusion. We're going to select that for our send and for our return. We've, we've named it SSL2 Plus Fusion plus input, so we know that it's coming back in to Studio One. So when we click play, we can tell we're getting signal. So that's good. It's very nice. We want to click auto. Auto basically lines up the sent audio, and it aligns the returned processed audio. So you're not getting any phasing issues. You're not getting any issues. Everything's just nice and in sync. And when you click the wrench again, you should be getting your main out, coming right back out to your audio interface. Let's recap. You go into your IO, depending on the type of audio interface you have, you want to add a stereo output, select the output route, left and right, name it, and do the same thing for input. Click apply, click okay. Come back into Studio One, open up Pipeline, hit Auto. It'll align your audio, uncheck the wrench, and you have your audio being processed through your hardware back into Studio One. It's not a problem. If you guys wanna see more content like this, click like and subscribe, hit that notification button. If you have a request for a video, don't forget to leave me a comment below. Hopefully this video added some value and got you closer to 212 degrees. I wanna thank you again for watching. It's your boy Secondborn. Until then, I'll catch you on the next video.